Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is the 12th tutorial in this course and in this tutorial we're going to see how we can sort and merge arrays in Perl. So I've got a script opened up here. It's called array underscore sort underscore merge and in this script on line number 3 I have created an array variable called string underscore ARR which has the elements 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7 and these are words and not numbers and uh, if these were numeric values and if they were present in the order uh, 1 to 7 then you could say that the array was already sorted but you know we're not working with numbers here but we're working with words and if you have a list in which you have words and if you would want to sort the list like you know something like a dictionary then it would make sense to sort the list alphabetically and that is what we're going to try to do but before we do that on line number four I've got a print statement that's first going to display the text original string list it's going to show a comma and then I am going to print the contents of this particular array right so I'm going to see words from one to seven in the order uh, that you see on line number three in the declaration statement here. Then on line number six I have made a call to the sort subroutine which is going to accept this array as an argument. So the sort subroutine accepts uh, an array as an argument, it sorts it and then I would want to store the result in something and in this particular case I'm storing the result in the same variable you know string underscore ARR. So this uh, sort function is going to accept this array as an argument it's going to sort it and it's going to store the results back into the same array then on line number seven I have a print statement that's going to show me the sorted list so that's about sorting and then uh, the next thing that we're going to check out in this tutorial is how to merge arrays so uh, on line number nine and on line number ten I have uh, created two more arrays uh, the first one's called ARR1 and it has numbers from 1 to 5. The second one's called ARR2 and it has numbers from 6 to 10. And what I want to do is I want to create an array that has numbers, uh, you know, from both these arrays. So, you know, in, in, in a way I want to take elements from this array and take elements from th this array and, you know, just merge them together and create another array. So, let's say I want to call that uh, array final underscore ARR. So, on line number 12 I have created it by typing its name, putting an equal to symbol and then just typing the names of these two arrays within parentheses and putting a comma in between. So if you had uh, another array variable here, let's say that if that was ARR3 then you could just put a comma here and put ARR3 and you know the contents of ARR3 would also be merged um, with these two arrays. And then finally on line number 13 I have a print statement that's going to display the contents of the merged array. Uh, which uh, is final ARR. So let me show you the output of the script. I'll have to press F5 to run it. So here we see the original string list 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. And then we see the sorted string list 5, 4, 1, 7, 6, 3, and 2. So you know this is the alphabetical order. And then uh, finally we see the merged array 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. And over here I have specified ARR1 first and that's why you see the elements from ARR1 before uh, elements from ARR2 and if you would change the order then you know the order in which the elements are stored in final ARR would also change. So that's it for now. I hope you guys like this tutorial. You may subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'm going to see you in the next video. Till then, take care.